Hi, this video is to show you how to end a deduction that had a goal but was paid off early. So in our scenario, um, Kathy has an employee who had a student loan uh, deduction with a goal and he has paid that off early. You've received notification that it's been completed. So now it's time to go in and turn off that deduction. So go ahead and go to the employee record and on his pay tab we'll go to deductions. Under student loan we're just going to click on that and all we have to do is end that date and we want to end it before the, the next pay date in our system. So um, today is actually a pay date in our system so I'm going to roll this back at least one day to ensure that it doesn't come out on our payroll today. Now if you've already processed payroll that would be a different scenario. So we're going to roll it back to the day before the next pay date to make sure that it doesn't get paid. We're going to save it and that's all you really have to do to stop something that has a goal. You can see that we had a goal of $3,000 on here um, but there's nothing more that we have to do on this because we've ended it. Now to prove that it's not going to come out on the next check, I'm going to do a test payroll uh, just to show you how this works. So under processing we've got the add edit pay statements. That's where I'm going to add a new pay statement. Pull up Josh. We're going to go to regular. I'm going to go ahead and enter some time for him. And that way we know that any deductions that should come up will. And you can see here in his deductions that there's no longer a student loan listed and there's no amount coming out current or, and there's no column for a goal. So there you go. That's all there is to it.